Hi guys, I hope you're all okay. I have been shopping. So I thought I would sit down and show you what I've been buying. This haul was kind of put together with two things in mind. Firstly, my holiday. I am going to Dubai in a few weeks time. And secondly, autumn, winter. I love autumn. So the first day that the sun had gone in and it started raining, I was like, hell yes, let's shop. I'm going to ask that you ignore the state of my hair. I am in fact going to get it done this afternoon and whereas I might have been the kind of person that washed and did their hair before going to the hairdressers a few years ago, I have not got the time for that anymore. So this is what we're working with today and yeah. In my last haul a few of you mentioned that I wasn't showing the clothes well enough. So I'm going to try and insert a few clips of me wearing them, so I hope that helps. I have got quite a bit to get through here, so let's get started. The first thing that I'm going to include in this haul is actually this jumper that I'm wearing now. It is from ASOS and it is, I think the brand is Weekday. It is like a paradise designed sweatshirt and I am obsessed with it. I love it so much. It's I think it's like kind of perfect balance between super super duper casual and I've made a little bit of an effort just purely because it's got a print. Um, really reasonable too. So yeah, I absolutely love this jumper. Those of you that watch my vlogs and stuff will know that I love casual t-shirts. That's my thing. I'm just always in a casual t-shirt. Black skinny jeans, boots, jacket, whatever, just really super duper casual and so I picked up this three pack of t-shirts there's the white the grey and the black which I've already worn let me take this one out they are from ASOS and they're just the perfect t-shirt super slouchy kind of oversized and long so you can wear them with like leggings and they've got a v-neck too this particular trio are the ribbed version I really love them and I think they're only £25 which for three t-shirts is a bargain. Next up I have a hoodie from Pull and Bear. I think this autumn winter I'm kind of go along the whole slouchy oversized look. I kind of go there every year but it's my favourite. I like to be comfortable and it's just like a kind of effortless look to achieve um, and I picked this up. now. This is just a cropped hoodie with a pocket, um, it's just really easy to wear, um, it's a lot shorter than I thought it would be, but I think it will work with some like high waisted jeans or something, I think it was pretty reasonable, I'm not sure on the price but I will link every single thing below, um, it doesn't even have the price on the tag, I think it was probably around the 20 to £30 pound mark. Um, but yeah, this is going to be perfect just for like mum days, even I think that's going to look amazing underneath like a leather jacket. So yeah, really excited to wear that. Next I picked up a um, like tartan shirt from ASOS, but it is actually from New Look, so I guess you could pick it up in either. Um, it just has a couple of little pockets on the front long sleeves and I believe, no this isn't oversized, this just looks like a regular fit and um, again I just, I, I always go back to like checked shirts and just oversized things, it's just, I guess it's just my style but with a pair of jeans, blue, black, whatever, it's just an easy outfit. Whilst we're talking shirts I also picked up this denim shirt from again Pull and Bear um, I'm not entirely sure I like it, but I think unbuttoned, let me have a, I'll do it in a minute, um, I think unbuttoned with like a white t-shirt or something, this will look quite cool, just again, really, really casual, but I don't know, I love layering, so this is, you know, I've got layering in mind with this, it's really quite thin actually for denim, let me unbutton it and poppage I say. It's got some really big like oversized pockets on the front, turned up sleeves and I think that was probably about £20. So the next item is another item from Weekday which is the same as this sweatshirt. 
and it's going to be really hard to show on camera now. It screams Kanye West to me, but I love that. I know that's going to be very controversial, but I love it. Um, and I think it was described somewhere along the lines of like a hoodie dress. Now, that's exactly what it is. It's a super, super oversized long hoodie. Um, and I'm just going to love, I know I'm going to love wearing it like with leggings and like Converse or trainers. On days where I'm just kind of doing nothing but popping out at the park, whatever. I'm going to love wearing it, I know. It's probably not everyone's style or taste, but it is... It's going to throw the colours off of this video completely because it is, like, huge um, and dark. So, yeah, it is a hoodie. So here we have the hood. Um, just super, super basic. Nothing else to it but... Just a big black hoodie, very very basic, with or without leggings, I think that's going to be amazing to wear and yeah, not everybody's style but I like it. The third weekday piece from ASOS that I have here is this stripy dress. Now I love stripy things, I have a whole rail here of stripy t-shirts. I am obsessed with stripes, it's actually quite embarrassing, so of course I had to pick this up, um, it is just a really kind of standard long sleeved dress, it can be worn with I guess leggings or on its own, it's a good length, um, yeah, <laughs> um, I'm really trying to show you guys the stuff that I've got here properly, um, yeah, pretty standard, but I know that I'm going to get so much wear out of it and I'm really, really excited to do so. So the next thing here is a Parker jacket. Now, I am obsessed with Parker jackets. Every single year I buy a new one. I have quite the collection of khaki Parker jackets and this year I thought I'd mix it up a little bit. <laughs> Every year I struggle to find one and it always ends up not being until like Christmas that I eventually decide on one or find one that I like and this was super reasonable so I thought just get it you won't regret it it's a jacket and I spend so much time like out at the park now or playing football in the garden or whatever I need a jacket so this is what I picked up now this is going to be impossible to show you holding up here so I'm just going to pop it on and then I'll probably insert like a cutaway or something I believe this was £35, where's the sleeve, which is so reasonable, um, here, it just has the furry hood which I like, it's just super, super cosy, I feel like I'm wearing a quilt, um, a hood for if it rains, and yeah, I think this is going to be really nice, I also love this colour. I'm going to start transitioning into like my holiday stuff now so the last kind of I think this is like the last autumn piece is this dress like shirt dress from Zara and um, it just has a white collar I absolutely love it grey again which I love uh, I believe that's a three quarter length sleeve and it's just like a really nice length that I can wear it with tights I guess and I guess like Chelsea boots which is my kind of go-to for um, autumn winter it was only um, 17 99 which is an absolute bargain so I had to buy that now the next thing I'm going to show you I'm not too sure on it's from Zara but I don't know if it's a little bit too like Barbie pink I know on holiday it will probably look all right but I'm not sure it does and will look like a bit of a tent on camera I'm sure um, it's just this dress here um, I love this style I really really do um, I love to have my shoulders out and have a bit of highlighter on my collarbones I know that sounds ridiculous but I really like this style um, it's just like a shirt dress I guess um, it is buttoned up all the way to the bottom as you can see here but for me it is quite pink and um, the sleeves have this cute little like lace up fastening I don't know I'm gonna have to try this on and have you tell me what you think um, 
yeah I don't know how much was this it was 25 99 so it wasn't too expensive um yeah what do you think do you think I have another pink piece here from Zara and this is actually a like hidden play suit which is very similar to my one from my I think it might be my last haul the denim one from Zara which I absolutely love and will be taking that on holiday with me too um it's just like a round neck it has like a I don't even know where to begin with describing that sleeve but I think once it's on it's not going to look so frilly I think it'll kind of look a little bit more I don't know where I'm going with this um, it's just a dress it has a it's quite short but again it does have the hidden shorts underneath making it entirely appropriate for me being a mum I'm always like bending over picking up Harrison stuff it just makes it's easy to wear for me um, it's buttoned up at the back and it was only again 25.99 not too expensive I think that's the kind of ideal price that you want to be paying for holiday stuff especially at this time of the year coming to the end of summer because I'm not going to get the wear out of it until like next year and by then I'm not going to want to wear it this will come as no surprise but it is one of my favorite things and it is a stripy dress yay um it has a really short sleeve um it's like a no, I don't know how to describe it. It's quite stretchy, but it looks like a... Do you know that, that crepey material? Um, it's a really, really nice length. You can see here. And I just had this in mind for, like, when I'm going to down to the pool or something. I'm not too much of a sarong beach cover-up girl. This is, like, my ideal. If I'm going to wear a bikini, I'm going to wear a bikini. But if I'm going to cover up, then I want something that covers me up. And this will do that. Um, really, really easy to wear. Again, you can dress it up and down. And I know that I'll probably end up wearing this as like an oversized t-shirt when I get back. Um, and it was only £12.99. Absolute bargain. And probably one of my favourite things here. I lied to you. I thought that I had got all of the autumn eat stuff out of the way. But I haven't. Um, I have this sweatshirt here um, with a pocket super super oversized and baggy I love it um short sleeve here with like a I never know what to call that I like to call it like a distressed hem or something it's just like very undone and um, really oversized perfect like dusky pink colour baggy pocket I love it I, I'm looking at the other stuff and actually with this sweatshirt and probably the stripy stuff this is my favourite I did get this from ASOS but it is misguided and I got this in a size 12 I believe that it was only around the £17 mark which is an absolute bargain and yeah I love this I'm sure you're going to see me wearing it loads I have three final things to show you in this haul two of them are black so i'm really sorry if they don't show up for camera very well it's super super duper hard because the lighting goes all funny and la -de da 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 the first one this one i'm going to show you next i'm not sure on the material to me feels a little bit cheap um it is this cold shoulder dress now i do love a cold shoulder i'm sure you'll know that from watching my vlogs and stuff really difficult to show you um that's one sleeve neck um second sleeve really pretty dress and i will link it below so you can see it on a model which will look 10 times more better um it's quite short but i just the material yeah it's a little bit stretchy not really my thing it was only 15.99 so maybe i will just wear it like on an evening on holiday or something but i'm not sure it's really not going to show up very well another dress that i just know is going to look like a tent it's not going to be flattering on camera at all it is just this really basic like t-shirt material dress it has turned up like t-shirt sleeves which 
I like. It covers up my bingo wings. Um, it has like a scoop back detail and then at the back it just has little ties I guess to pull you in in all of the right places um, this was only again 15 99 super reasonable and worn like dressed up as a dress or well it is a dress or as a beach cover up I think that's going to be perfect the next item here is something that I know that I would buy like every year because it's very me the colour the style the design it's just a very me dress and it is this dress here from Honey Bunch Honey Punch sorry um on ASOS it is just a v-neck dress with like a baggy sleeve that comes I guess to about here which is my favourite just super super baggy casual perfect with sandals with heels with flip-flops anything it can just be dressed up and down it's beautiful I love it and um, it has like embroidered detailing on here oh I just love it so much I think it was about 35 pounds I think um, I hope I'm not lying there it's just perfect so floaty beautiful perfect like thickness I adore it and I think just like the, just a couple of bits in this haul, I will probably wear this once I'm back home as well, maybe with like jeans, I don't know, I just want to wear it all the time because I absolutely love it. The order that I thought was going to come didn't actually come but I have ordered a couple of things on Topshop, I ordered um, another cold shoulder dress um, and a grey boyfriend style t-shirt surprise um so yeah maybe i'll include them in another haul soon but i will link them below because the cold shoulder dress is absolutely beautiful so that is my haul i hope that you enjoyed it i'm really sorry if it got a little bit rambly i did have quite a bit to get through um and also i really hope that i showed off the clothes well enough this time for you so yeah let me know what you like what you didn't like and let me know your opinion on the things that i wasn't sure on um but yeah i will make sure that i link every single thing in the description box below so you can find it and buy it thank you so so much for watching head over to my facebook page because i'm posting on there a hell of a lot more i'm uploading like little videos and pictures and stuff that i'm not posting anywhere else and make sure you follow me on instagram too because that's my favorite and yeah, if you're a new viewer of this channel, please, please, please make sure you subscribe. It's free. And yeah, thank you. And I'll see you soon.